Since building their original facilities in 2011, the National Joint Powers Alliance in Staples has tripled their staff, causing them to expand. This week, they invited the community to tour their new expansion and to hear their plans for the future. Our Logan Gay has more. It's only been five years and the National Joint Powers Alliance outgrew their facilities in Staples. In order to keep up with the growth, they decided to expand. Gives us the opportunity to continue to expand here under the same roof, uh, expand our services, expand our, expand our employee profile, uh, all here in Staples, Minnesota. The third 2,000 square foot expansion will be the home of 75 new employees and offers additional office space, training rooms, and even a fitness facility. We did indeed add a small fitness center uh, as we believe um, as we continue to bring on new employees. We want them to be healthy. We want uh, them to be thinking about health both for themselves, uh, for their families, and for the organization as a whole. With a new addition, NJPA will be able to continue their mission of exceeding the expectations of their members. So we're truly appreciative of the position we're in to be able to make this expansion, to continue to hire on and, and provide additional services uh, for our region and for our state and beyond. Community leaders attended the open house to show their support for NJPA and their vision for the future. Oh, this is a great opportunity for the city of Staples. NJPA, um, I guess we're just very fortunate to have you know, 100 plus employees um, and to have this building, this facility in our community and not only represent Staples, but it represent this region. Um, we're just very fortunate and very excited for their future. In Staples, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. The National Joint Powers Alliance officially started moving into their facilities in June. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.